I'm Pete Combs at the Orange County Convention Center as we get ready for NBAA's 65th meeting and convention here in Orlando, which starts on Tuesday. More than 25,000 people are expected to fill this convention center. Both here and at the Orlando Executive Airport, you'll find some 100 aircraft on static display, and you can expect new product announcements as well as education sessions that run the gamut from international operations to iPads in the cockpit. NBAA President Ed Boland tells me advocates will also play a big role here at the convention. We'll be unveiling at this convention a number of new ads that we have related to the No Plain, No Gain campaign. We'll also have a number of advocacy tools available where people can go online. And we'll be doing a joint session with the heads of various general aviation associations with the Alliance for Aviation Across America which we'll be talking about some of their new online resources. So a real opportunity for us to present the truth about business aviation to a very wide audience because we can get all of the attendees involved in the process. As we get ready for the convention here in Orlando, the National Business Aviation Association is carefully monitoring developments that could have a tremendous impact on members all along the eastern seaboard, as well as right here in Florida. First, there's the threat posed by Hurricane Sandy. NBAA and members of its HERO database are following developments associated with Sandy, ready to act if needed. And then there's the election, now just a week away. The reality is Orlando is the swing part of a very critical swing state. And so understanding that reality, the president's going to be here. We, uh, you know, we'll just have to do our best to communicate with the government agencies involved and communicate with all of our attendees to make sure there's as much transparency as possible. Uh, but we will work through this. In the meantime, the process of setting up this massive convention continues here in Orlando. You've heard of the calm before the storm. Well, this is the storm before the show. Hundreds of people are hard at work here at the Orange County Convention Center putting the finishing touches on NBAA 2012. This is the biggest convention Orlando will see all year long, and it's another example of the jobs created by aviation. This convention is a huge contributor to the Orlando economy in two ways, both tangible and intangible. You know, their attendance around 25,000. It brings about an economic impact, about 33 million to the local area, which benefits all. It benefits the convention center district, the restaurants, the hotels, the attractions, the shopping. So having NBAA as a partner in our community is wonderful. Orlando also gets a big intangible benefit from this convention. The thousands of corporate leaders who come to NBAA 2012, giving Orlando a chance to make a great impression on companies that could someday be looking for a new corporate hometown. NBAA members have always said this organization is good for business. Vicki Kelleher says folks here in Orlando most certainly agree. At NBAA 2012 in Orlando, I'm Pete Combs.